Hello, welcome to this tying demonstration by Fishbait's Flybox. Today I'm going to demonstrate how to tie a pumpkin head mohair leech. Um, I had recently had some success with this fly at a Stillwater Reservoir I had and I wanted to share it with you. Uh, in the vise I have a fire hole 839 and it's a size 8 and this is a 3XL long 3XL hook and as you can see it's a very heavy duty hook. These are some really good hooks. Um, they are they got really good points and it's a competition style hook and it's barbless. It's just a really good hook. Um, um, thread I'm using is a 6 aught rusty brown and I'm going to take, what I've done is I've taken some mohair, some mohair yarn and I've stripped the fibers out and I've kind of evened them up and I'm going to take and about halfway start of the thread went all the way down and back up to halfway, halfway point of the hook and I'm going to take and tie this in um, in the halfway point of the uh, mohair fibers. Then I'm going to fold it over like so and we're going to continue to tie them back down the shank. Now I learned this fly from Mike and Drayson. Uh, he's got a DVD out and it's a really good, it's, in my opinion it's a good DVD for, especially for still water patterns. And then we'll take the to the head of the fly, take the thread to the head of the fly and we'll take and trim the tail Then I'm going to tie in some mohair. And I'm going to tie it in so I have a little bit of a the gap between here and here is left over uh, at hanging off the end the head of the fly. I'll use that to help even up the body. And I'll tie the tie the fiber all the way down where the tail is, I'll bring the fibers back up, thread back up, and I'm going to fold that over. As you can see, I've, that allowed me to, to even up the body. How essential it is, I don't know, but we're going to do it anyway. Okay, from here, we're going to take our mohair, and we're going to start wrapping it around the hook shank. As we do this, actually, hold it, I want to do something else first. We're going to take our Velcro stick, and we're loosening up these fibers on this yarn. Okay, and now we'll take and start wrapping around the hook shank. As we do this, we'll pull the fibers back. And at that, about that point, we're going to tie off the mohair yarn. And from here, we'll put a couple more secure wraps. Ouch, that hook is sharp. From here, we're going to take some. Ice Dub UV Hot Orange. Hence the pump hit name Pumpkinhead. I'll wrap that there real good. And then we'll take and do apply a whip finish. Uh, let me take some Sally Anton's Hard as Nails and coat the thread with it. And then we'll grab a whip finish and we'll whip finish the fly.
Another thing I like to do after I've gotten to this point is I take my Velcro again and I'm going to brush that um, dubbing out a little bit. Not a lot, just a little bit. And then we'll take our scissors again and we will trim it up like so. And there it is. Mohair leech. This is a deadly pattern for me last week and I really like the, like the pattern, really like the fly. So anyway, thanks for watching. Please like Fish Base Fly Box on Facebook and subscribe to Landstein's YouTube channel. And uh, stay up to date with Fish Base Fly Box by going to fishbaseflybox.com. Thank you and have a nice day.